Husky Girl coming at you with more movie reviews. This is Indiana Jones, The Dial of Destiny. This is actually a, ne a decent one. I mean, it, it kind of comes full circle. I really liked it. It wasn't like the best Indiana Jones by no means, but it was decent. Um, I'm going to give it a three on my action meter because, I mean, dude, it's Indiana Jones and Harrison Ford. Come on. But, yeah, Harrison rejoins us, and just, I don't care how old that man gets, he will look fantastic forever. And, uh, yeah, he's trying to find uh, these artifacts, of course, but it's a fake, and he ends up finding this Dial of Destiny with his friend Basil. And skip two years later... They're trying to figure out what it does, blah, blah, blah. They're supposed to get rid of it. Basil has went completely cuckoo crazy trying to figure this thing out, thinking it's an actual time travel device, which is interesting on its own. Problem is, he runs into his goddaughter, Helena, which is Basil's daughter. She's trying to steal it because now she's gotten through a hard life and whatnot, and Indy is trying to run away from the Nazis as usual. It, it's decent. I'm not gonna I'm not saying nothing about it. I like how it makes come full circle. You know how I am with nostalgia and things like that. It is perfect for that. But yeah. Y'all let me know what you think about it down in the comments. Let me know if there's anything else y'all want me to watch or review or anything else or play. Cause yeah we're doing Twitch now and it's an FYI. But yeah, let me know if there's anything else y'all want me to do. Give me a like, give me a subscribe. We will see y'all later.